Hey everybody, today I'm going to show you a Playmore camper. It's P-L-A-Y-M-O-R. And let me show you here on the front how that is. And this is Cheryl here, and she's going to tell us about the camper, but check out the car that they're towing it with. This is actually light blue. It looks kind of gray in the picture. What year is the car? It's a 58 Ford. 58 Ford, look at that. And that gorgeous. Really she said her husband redid all the bodywork and restoration. And there, so we're going to look at the camper now, and Cheryl's going to tell us about it. And she just made this awning of like La Paisley fabric. is so cute. So tell me, what what year is the camper? It's a 73, 73 Playmore. I've had it about four years and bought it from a family in Irwin, Tennessee. And it was pretty rough shape when I got it. It was um, completely gutted inside. So I got to restore it back to the way I wanted it. And make it useful for you. And make it, yeah, personalized it for me and put a double bed in it so me and my husband can turn it. Okay, so you and your husband restored this? He helped me a little bit, yeah. But most of it you did <laughs> most yourself? Most of it I did myself. Good uh, for you. Yeah, and... Um, now, did, is that all new wood on the walls and ceiling? Did you put that in? That was what was in it when I got it, but I took it all out. It was um, orange and black Harley colors. Okay. So I took it out, insulated everything, put new wiring in it, new lights and put it back up and painted it all white and found a cabinet for the my kitchen and and that uh, works good dad do you cook inside i do have a propane um little stove that i can cook in cook on but um if it's raining or whatever and but we have it out on the picnic table right now so they took the dinette out and they put this little table here, like a shelf, which gives them a lot more room for other stuff. And she can put her food up there. And did you have to put the new floor in? We did. We put the new floor in, and uh, it has a step down in, so my husband can stand up because this is about exactly six foot. Was it step down when you got it, or did yeah, you do it? Okay, because that's, that's like a are. Scotty. Right. Yeah, the That's Scotties the are stepped down. Scotties, they all have the, I think Playmores have the step down. Okay, I'm going to show you around this side. Little hooks up there and a cute little lamp. Now, she does not have air conditioning in this. She has a uh, motorized, like, fantastic fan up here right. in the ceiling. Yep. And what did you have to do to the outside? Pa just paint it? Paint it. My husband painted it with the same colors as his car. And um, that's pretty much all we did to the outside. He did put the little eyebrows on it just a couple of weeks ago. And, okay. And, and you have a trunk back for storage. Now tell me about this cooler. The cooler is um, you, works on a um, battery pack, like a drill. A battery drill works mm -hmm. on. You plug it in, put your ice in there, keeps your food cool, and then you can turn it on and it will blow out cool air. And you can air condition your camper or your car. So it works like a swamp cooler. That's what they call them, I think. Yeah. Looks good, and it matches the car perfect. Thank you, Cheryl. What is your favorite thing about this camper? Um, I like it because it's small. I can pull it in the car, drive it. and um, Do you go just, camping with the girls? No, just me no. and my husband. Okay. We've taken it to the beach. We've taken it to, um, um, let's see, car shows. We go to car shows a lot. My husband's into drag racing, so... Uh, and we take it to Carolina Push Rods car show, which is coming up in August, and uh, set it up 
So if you're going there, look for them and say hello. Yes. All right, Cheryl, thank you for showing it to us. Well, thank you for stopping by. Give it a thumbs up, everybody. And subscribe if you haven't already. It's free. Bye. Bye.